go fuck yourself. Okay? All of you. The, the Constitution is at risk. But that's the one time that James Carville's got some shit right. All right, here we go. Let's roll. What's up, everybody? All right, all right. I want to thank all the wonderful people for tuning in yesterday. Last night's live stream was a, was a hoot. Um, we had a great time going through articles and um, checking out videos of how the left and their somewhat of a botched takeover of America gives us a quite humorful, <laughs> that's not even a word, insight into what their plan is. I mean, they've gotten to the point now where they've just reached a whole new level of insanity to where we can just easily see in real time what they're, you know, what they're up to. But it's, it's almost like, really? When it comes to like people like Tim Waltz and, and Kamala Harris, but they're just a face of the globalist. But, you know, in other videos I've talked about Trump, I'm like, man, Trump has, um, was a savage in 2016. And I, and I miss that, that energy. I really do. And here, this video, we're going to go through a couple of little, little gaffes. Or not gaffes, but Trump brings out some 2016 energy. And uh, he was at a, at a Al Smith dinner in New York City. So New York, his, home, his hometown, got a lot of businesses there. <laughs> he, he, you know, this is where it's at. This is where the left just can't comprehend anything. But here, check this out. So he he's gives a presentation or like a speech or whatever, you know, way better than <laughs> you, had, uh, you had Bill Clinton talking about banging RFK Jr.'s mama when he was, when they were young. <laughs> he's like, I wanted to do your mama, but let's watch this. It's a true pleasure to be with you this evening. Amazing pleasure. And uh, these days it's uh, really a pleasure anywhere in New York without a subpoena for my appearance. <laughs> <laughs> That's good stuff. I mean, it's, if you can, when you can meme yourself, you know, there, when you when you when you do that, it takes all the steam out of what they've been trying to do. This was another good one. I had to. I, Joe has almost disappeared from view. The only way he could be seen less is if he had a show on CNN. They have nothing. <laughs> they've got nothing. <laughs> it's killing it to CNN because yeah, CNN sucks. And, uh, and, and and what's funny is that you've got, he's about to bust loose on Chuck Schumer, who is down here, right here to to, the, to Trump's left, but our right, bottom bottom right over here, which you probably can't see because my, my I'm in the way, but trust me, he's down there now. Now he's coming up. This is epic. I, I mean, <laughs> oh my gosh. There's a group called White Dudes for Harris. Have you seen this? White Dudes for Harris. Anybody know? It? Are some of you here? White Dudes for Harris doesn't sound like it. But I'm not worried about them at all because their wives and their wives' lovers are all voting for me. Oh, 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 <laughs> no. We'll get, we'll get to the Chuck Schubert. Oh, my gosh. Watch this. I used to think the Democrats were crazy for saying that men have... Periods, but then I met Tim Waltz. <laughs> the look on Chuck Schumer's face. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me let me get over here and move my screen out of the way. You've got to see this. Hold on a second. Let me let me, you, dude. Chuck Schumer's face when he talks about Tim Waltz. You can see what side he's on. This is epic. Watch this right here. Check this out. So you got Chuck Schumer down here on the bottom right. <laughs> I used to think the Democrats were crazy for saying that men have periods, but then I met Tim Waltz. And, uh, look, Chuck Schumer's like, well, wait, hold on a damn minute here, son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, all right, here we go. Uh, the, 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 this is good. This is, this is epic. Chuck Schumer is here looking very glum. <laughs> This day looks lovely. Oh, it looks this is what I'm talking about. Right there in your face, talking mad shit. Watch this. <laughs> but look on the bright side, Chuck, considering how woke your party has become. If Kamala loses, you still have a chance to become the first woman president. <laughs> Chuck Schumer's like, Where's that? We need another Ryan Roth. Can we get a Ryan Roth, please? Somebody, anybody. And I actually said, do you mind if I do that? And he said, no, you got to do what you got to do. He's a pro. He's a professional. 
Oh, he minded Chuck all right. Chuck Schumer. He, he, uh, <laughs> he minded it, but he, what do you do? You know, you can't, uh, <laughs> we need, I want to see that energy on the campaign trail. I would love to have seen that in the debate with, with Kamala Harris or, 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 you know, like, you know, come on, like J.D. Vance, bust out some of that energy on Tim Walz, but. Unfortunately, we only had one, you know, vice presidential debate for some strange reason. I'm sorry, why is Vice President uh, Harris not here? <laughs> All right, well, that was fun. Going back to work. Big hugs. I'm out. It is not quite right. How do you give it back? <laughs> Governor, what kind of gun is it? This is a Beretta A400. I brought, I bought it when I was shooting a lot of uh, trash because it has a. <laughs>